Good morning to you. And how about we start with some Wookie Nookie? What? Oh. Oh. Yeah, I said it. William Shatner Ew. thinks the new Star Wars movie needs to make it to, to make the new Star Wars movie a blockbuster. He right. tells Jimmy Kimmel last night what J.J. Abrams needs to do, do, and he thinks that Chewbacca and Princess Leia should get <laughs> no, together no, for some no, intergalactic no, no, no. love. Uh, I don't want that visual. Also oh, appearing no, on it. Jimmy Kimmel, Billy D. Williams. He sees love in the stars as well. The heartthrob who played Lando Calrissian in the Star Wars series made the surprise appearance suggesting the movie should be two hours, and I quote, of Lando and beautiful ladies making sweet love oh, in the galaxy. Oh, boy. Yeah. Can you scrub the image now yeah. that we all have? <laughs> can we? Is, that, is there a pill of Chewbacca? we can take? And oh. Princess Leia? No, no, no. No, no. Oh. no. All right, let's talk scandal, shall we? Last night, at the same time, as millions of fans were watching the explosive season finale, a parallel finale was playing out live at the Academy of Television Arts and Sciences in North Hollywood. President Grant, Olivia Pope, and all the gladiators were brought to life as the cast did a live table read oh, cool. of the entire episode, line for line. <laughs> Shonda Rhimes tweeting, there's nothing like a theater and a great audience. Meanwhile, fans just about broke Twitter with hashtags for scandal trending nationwide hours before the finale aired. And of course, after the jaw-dropping closing minutes, which I didn't get to, to stay up to well, see. Yeah, we're not yeah. So la, 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 don't tell us. And don't go on Twitter, because I almost... No. Uh -oh. It's very exciting. I, anyway, and finally, uh, Josh, you were saying that a lot of people aren't spending money at some stores, yeah. but the art world not seeing that at all. In nope. fact, the art world on fire with record-setting prices. The latest example is a controversial painting called Be Arthur Naked. What? It sold this week I mean, at Christie's <laughs> for $1.9 million, giving what? new meaning to the term Golden Girls. <laughs> Did you really say that? That was really good. I laughed. But truth Arthur. be told, Larry has been cracking herself up all morning <laughs> yeah. that line. When it first came to her, what, about an hour and a half ago? She started chuckling to herself as she typed it in. And now you get to do it again. I'm so happy. Um, Arthur never sat for the artist, John Curran, whose really? other works hang in the Whitney Museum. So this is a real He's a serious important And we don't know painting. if she posed for this, right? Or if no, no, she did she not She didn't pose. She, she did not sit for it. Because now I have a visual. See, that was just, I have another visual. So that was her his visual. Her B-cups were not... <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm done. Thank you.